Good morning, this is Spence with Weicker Realtors SPM and today I am at 9826 Memphis Arlington Road in Lakeland. I'm going to do a quick condition video on this uh, rental home that we have. As you see, uh, the front yard is uh, in pretty good condition. There, there's some few tree limbs and, and stuff that need to be cleaned up and leaves, that kind of thing. Um, As we come around the side, oh, it looks pretty good there. Uh, I'd like to point out that I am a licensed real estate agent. I am not a licensed contractor, so any major systems will need to be checked by a professional. So far, flyer beds and everything look to be in pretty good order. Uh, maybe just cleaned out a little bit, but they're not overgrown or anything. Um, coming around the side here. Garage. All right. So let's, uh, let's head inside now and check out the interior of the home. All right, um, coming in the front door, um, we've got the foyer area and the stairs going upstairs. We're actually going to do the upstairs first. Uh, stairs look to be in pretty good condition. Carpet. This, there we go. Uh, carpet, as you see, does have a few stains on it. Um, when we come into this room here, uh, the lights um, as you see the, the light bulbs are not working very well um, the room itself has a wood floor um, it does have some spots in it that are a little scratched up um, then you come over to this closet Obviously, as you see, there's a few things left behind in it. And let me get this light real quick. Um, so we'll head back downstairs now and check out the rest of the house. Uh, the ceilings, I can't get a real good look at the ceilings in here uh, just simply because they're the lights are not working well i don't see any issues right off the bat though uh, anywhere on the ceiling this living area. Um, it actually looks really good. Uh, the walls look good. I don't see any issues with the walls or the floor or the ceiling. The only thing I will say is you see around the air vents, uh, it's a little dirty. Got a lot of uh, black on them. Uh, I don't know if that's I don't think it's mold. Uh, and then coming into the kitchen. Counters all look good. Stove looks uh, good. It actually looks pretty clean. Uh, the floor 
does have a spot here. Looks like there was probably some water damage right here at some point. Um, but coming through over to the Eden area, uh, the back door here is definitely scratched up quite a bit. As you see. Uh, coming out into the garage. Looks like it has been cleaned out. The garage does not, as you see there, just got a pretty good gap at the bottom. Um, it might need to be looked at because um, it would allow a lot of water, possibly critters to come in. Um, you do have a hole here in the wall. We've got a separate little room here. It looks like this is probably, yeah, this may be your washer and dryer hookups. Um, ceiling is bowed a little bit right there. I don't know if you can see that on the video or not, uh, but it is bowed out a little bit. It is pulling away from the wall uh, there at the top in a couple of places. That's all your boxes there. And coming back into the house. Coming around. Um, see the lights there. I don't know if there's supposed to be covers on those or not. Um, then coming down into the den area. Uh, the carpet is okay. Um, I mean, you can tell it's definitely worn in some areas, uh, but not too terribly bad. The walls actually all looked good. Um, they may have been recently painted. They, they look uh, very clean all the way through. Uh, you do have a closet here under the stairs. And then coming into other side of the house, you have your bathroom here. Everything looks good. The uh, water is turned off, so I'm not able to check that. Um, coming into this first room here. Again, everything actually looks uh, really good. Floors look good, ceilings look good. Um, there are a couple of blinds that are bent. Um, one here, it looks like it may be falling down a little bit. Actually, that is the window frame itself that is coming down. Uh, that may need to be looked at. through down the hallway to this back bedroom. Again, the walls and the ceilings look good. This floor um, looks good. Again, you do have the uh, dark stuff on the air vent in here. It is pretty dark in there. Um, these blinds are pretty messed up, as you see. here. The parquet floor actually looks pretty good. Walls look good. Ceiling all looks good. Closet. And coming back to the primary.
Again, I don't see any issues on the ceiling um, or the floors. Um, we do have a couple of little spots. Um, I can see there a few scratches on the floor. Closets. All look pretty good. And then the uh, primary bath. Um, as you can see, you do have the uh, drop-in tub. That's a good step down in there. Um, and it's definitely a little bit older model. Um, again, uh, without water or anything, I'm not able to test anything like that. Um, some cabinet. So we will head back through and we're going to head outside quickly and check out the backyard. Okay, so coming out the back door, you do come out to uh, the patio here. Um, ton of leaves, as you see. Coming around. Roof there. Um, and as you see, you do have um, the construction in the back of the new uh, shopping center and everything that's being built. Um, also in the back here, you see there is a little bit of debris, trash that's been left. Uh, it looks like down at the end of the property there you see you have the, the white fence that goes down there is a wire very thin wire fence down there as well and then on this side it looks like you have the constru construction uh, fence but it has been broken down um, fallen down on that side of the house and do have a fire pit um, out here in the back as well All right, that concludes this walkthrough on uh, Memphis Arlington Road. Thank you for watching. And quickly, as I turned around to go back in, I did notice this on the uh, back of the door. Um, so that back door is definitely gonna need to be uh, probably replaced. All right, again, this is uh, 9826 Memphis Arlington. Thank you for watching.